In this tutorial, we are introducing our new logo and updating our tutorial for rejuvenating millings and preserving existing asphalt pavement with our new formula that penetrates deeper and cures faster. Hawksill has been preserving asphalt and rejuvenating millings for nearly 25 years. We have been the exclusive direct distributor for 12 years, shipping direct to customers in all 50 states and Canada. Recycled millings has become a popular economical alternative to hot mix asphalt and concrete. However, getting a smooth, non-tracking, non-eroding surface has been a challenge, which are the two most common complaints when using millings for driveways and parking lots. When using millings, we recommend three to four inches over a good solid base. This will compact to approximately two and a half inches after being treated with Hawk Seal and compacted. Good truck drivers can tailgate millings and eliminate much of the work in grading and shaping your project. An advantage of millings is small projects don't require large equipment. These millings were placed and treated with Hawk Seal solution to create a smooth and durable surface that will not crack, ravel, or erode, and can stand up to snow plows. A wide variety of equipment can be used to construct millings roadways. Using large equipment like skid steers and four foot or larger rollers can make construction of milling projects fairly fast. Hawk seal can also be used when repairing existing deteriorated pavements. The deteriorated sections can be milled and left in place, then leveled and treated with Hawk seal and then recompacted to create a new smooth durable surface saving time and money and the cost of removing the old material and bringing in new. The two major concerns with using raw millings is they tend to ravel and the fines track into vehicles, garages and homes and are also subject to erosion. Oxyl solution can be applied to both compacted and uncompacted millings to prevent this. Hawk Seal's coal palmers and binders rejuvenate and rebond the aggregate and asphalt in the millings to create a smooth, durable, non-tracking, non-eroding surface. These core samples are from a millings driveway that was laid four inches deep and treated with one gallon of Hawk Seal solution per square yard. The cores ranged from two to two and a half inches thick. Treated millings will compact about 30%. When constructing roadways deeper than normal, three to four inches deep, we recommend doing it in two, three to four inch lifts. Hawk Seal is non-hazardous, it's safe for the environment, and contains a proprietary blend of palmers and binders that rejuvenate the asphalt and rebonds the aggregate and the asphalt in the millings. Incorporating or surface applying Hawk Seal to millings will create a tight, durable, waterproof surface and prevent raveling, erosion, and tracking. Incorporation of the Hawk Seal solution can be beneficial, but it's not necessary with our new formula, which has better penetration. We recommend applying one gallon plus or minus per square yard for both compacted and uncompacted millings. Some millings may require more Hawk Seal solution to fully saturate them. In this photo, we are applying and incorporating a total of one gallon of Hawk Seal solution in three separate passes to get maximum saturation and incorporation to rebond the millings. The first pass will take approximately half a gallon of solution, with each successive pass taking less solution, coming to a total on average of about a gallon per square yard. Notice the Hawk Seal solution is standing in the tractor tracks. Your goal is to saturate the millings to the point that they are almost a slurry similar to pouring concrete. In very hot temperatures of 80 to 95 degrees or hotter, you will want to begin compacting the uncompacted millings after the second application. Then apply the third application and recompact. Compacted millings can be recompacted immediately after the third application. So to clarify that, if they're already down, which probably 90% of the people that call us are calling about compacted millings. You just apply your three applications and re-roll your pavement. This sprayer was set up with a two inch square tube 
with, inch, with half inch nipples every six inches with 80-50 fan jet nozzles. The nozzles can be spaced up to 12 inches apart and carried approximately 16 to 18 inches off the ground. Two inch trench pumps will supply enough volume at an idle with inch and a half PVC and or hose. A valve located close to the operator to control the boom works nicely and a 50 foot 5 8 high quality hose with a wand is used for small projects and tight spaces. The tank and sprayer setups can be mounted on trailers and trucks. You can find more information on our website at hawkseal.com. Millings will require a spray application. In this photo, a single wand is being used to apply the solution to a small project. Hawk Seal does not require high-tech or expensive equipment. Tanks or drums can be mounted on trucks or trailers, and sprinkle cans can be used for small projects. Compacting can begin immediately after the second app application on uncompacted millings, then apply the third application and recompact. Again, compacted millings can be recompacted after application of all three passes. This Hawkseal Millings driveway is now seven years old. Looks good, don't it? Using Hawkseal to seal and preserve asphalt pavement. Applying Hawkseal as a pavement preservative is done in three coats to fill the voids and fissures from the bottom up with a total application rate of about 0.35 to 4.4 point <laughs> fiddle, 4.2 tenths gallons per square yard. So it takes about a third of a gallon in simple terms. Hawk seal prevents the air and moisture from entering the pavement, which are the two main causes of asphalt deterioration and failure. Once the fissures and voids are filled, the deterioration stops and the pavement will last for many, many years. Have you ever noticed that streets paved with asphalt last longer than driveways and parking lots that have been laid at the same time with the same hot mix? Well, here's the reason. Asphalt is like a sponge. It needs traffic to stay compacted to prevent air and moisture from entering it. Without traffic, air enters the asphalt, drying it out, and then this allows moisture to enter the asphalt. Then heat causes the moisture to steam the lighter asphalt particles out reducing the adhesive properties of the asphalt. Then the freeze-thaw cycles force the asphalt particles apart, which allows more air and moisture to enter the surface, and the process begins over and over with increasing deterioration with each cycle. Eventually, it leads to major repairs. Traditional top coatings remain on top of the pavement, and they actually trap the moisture coming up from under the asphalt in the in the surface. This trapped moisture actually causes the asphalt to deteriorate faster as the heat steams the moisture out, taking the lighter asphalt particles with it. This is what you smell when you walk across a hot asphalt surface in the summertime. Hawk seal is absorbed into the pavement, filling the fissures and the voids to prevent air and moisture from entering the asphalt, permanently stopping the damaging freeze-thaw cycles. This slide shows the east, or left side here, and the west ends of Red Oak Street. This street was five years old when the west end was treated with hawk seal. Notice the difference after 25 years. The east end actually is needing to be totally replaced. Any larger tank or drum can be used for transporting and mixing your hawk seal solution and any pump that can adequately supply a fair amount of volume at a lower pressure can be used. Low-cost trash pumps are best for most projects. We've used utility pumps with plastic impellers for small projects as well. You, can construct a, you want to construct a bypass return line from your pump back to the tank for agitation and to regulate the pressure on the water boom. This will also keep from pushing the seals out on a water trash pump. Uh, you use a higher quality garden hose to connect the pump and the sprayer wand. You'll want to shut off at the wand to provide control of your spray. Uh, cage tanks can be found at most farm co-ops or egg suppliers. 
You can view or request our application and sprayer tool guides on our website at hawkseal.com. We hope this tutorial has been beneficial in your decision making as to whether millings can be a satisfactory solution to higher cost hot mix or concrete. We're planning on implementing a cost comparison calculator based on average costs to compare the options on our website. Generally, Hawk Seal milling roadways can be done for about a fourth of the cost of concrete and about half the cost of hot mix. Please feel free to contact us through our website for a quote or just to discuss your options. And with that, thank you for watching our video and uh, we hope we can be of service to you. And you can visit our website for more information or use our online calculator. And you can order online now at hawkseal.com. And feel free to call us. Uh, we'd love to discuss your project uh, and uh, help you in any way that we can. And with that, we'll close. Thank you.